This is the best woodworking vise that I have ever seen. If you guys are anything like me, your woodworking bench is like a cornerstone of your shop. You're, you're here all the time. You're, you're doing layout of your parts, your, your sanding parts, um, hand planing, cutting little details, doing dovetailing, you name it. You're doing a million different tasks at your workbench. And a workbench, other, other than being a place to kind of have everything that you need organized near you, the most important part about it for doing all those tasks that I just mentioned is work holding. You need a great vice. And for me, I just built this new bench so that I could put in a wagon vice. If your bench in your shop is anything like what my bench was, then you probably know how I feel. I had an Envice store-bought that was slow. I think it had six revolutions per inch on travel speed, so it was slow. You're just doing this all day, loosening and, and tightening, and it was a little bit weak as an end vise, um, and it wasn't that useful to me in this position. Anyway, it was usually strong enough for, a, for clamping on the bench between dog holes, as long as you tightened it good. Um, but it didn't have versatility, like being able to clamp something in, in the hole. Um, so I started looking at a lot that are, that are available online. Um, wood screws, wood screw vices that are available online. And some of them are very nice. Um, and I'm sure you guys have heard of them, but none of them were exactly what I wanted. The closest I could find was one that was the screw was two and a half inch diameter, and then the end where where the uh, crank handle is is more like three and a half, I think, diameter. So it's very large, um, and it's it's faster than anything else on the market. I think it's two threads per inch, so only two revolutions and it goes an inch. But with my saw location i'm using this my bench is my catch so it's important for me to not have a huge handle here so that i can run work across it like that and i'm not running into my handle um, so i designed this with a two inch diameter thread and i don't have a huge block right here that's hard to get over and I don't see any need for it. This is super strong as it is. I've used it on many things and never had a problem. It's never been, uh, you know, a little weak or feeling weak. Um, and I designed it with one thread per inch count. So one revolution and it has traveled an inch. So it's twice as fast as the best thing on the market, which I love. Um, and if it was if it was only that one thread, it would be a little weak, but it's double threaded. The screw and the nut block are double threaded so that there's actually two threads spinning around each other similar to like DNA. Um, so, you get the extreme speed with good strength. Technically speaking, it probably has a little bit less strength than a, than a two thread per inch wood screw, but I can't tell. I build furniture here, all kinds of, I, I do large pieces clamping and 
like I say, I haven't had any problems. And the, vers the versatility of being able to clamp in here like this for, for dovetailing or whatever has been great. And as soon as you feel you've come up on the board, you just tighten just a little bit and it just becomes rock solid. Rock solid, like you can shake the whole bench. But I've loved it every day of using it. I don't know how I got along without it. Well, I got the exact vise that I wanted. Super strong, versatile, extremely fast. Um, but it was a lot of trouble. Obviously, building a screw and nut block from scratch, it's unbelievable. The engineering that goes into it and, and making very nice jigs so that you end up with a screw that's very accurate and a nut block that's very accurate so that you can just build it and they work. If it doesn't work to begin with, you can't sand it and fix it and play with it. It just has to, it just has to be right. So the jigs have to be really good. I made great jigs. So, instead of doing all that work for my one vice, I'm making more. I'm making a, a vice kit that includes the three main parts, the nut block, the screw and the crank handle. And I think those are the parts that are complicated enough that most woodworkers are just not gonna wanna even try to mess with it. It takes too long, blah, blah, blah. Um, but I know a lot of guys that want a new bench and they want good work holding, so I'm making these kits available and you can use it as an end vise, tail vise, uh, leg vise, or like I did, a wagon vise. Um, you build your own wagon, every wagon is gonna be different. It's, it's built into your bench. Um, well, I hope you liked this video. And I hope you love the screw vise as much as I do. If you do, click on the link below and get started. We'll send you one.